Well, I just can't stop thinking about her. Fritz Schaefer's wife, Victoria, his best friend and mother to their four children, is missed by many in their Chillicothe community. Our whole community is grieving right now um, because she was such an amazing person. Like, there's, there's a hole, like a void now. What makes the pain even worse, not knowing how part of a tree fell on the 44-year-old photographer while she was on a photo shoot with high school seniors at Old Man's Cave. We've been told that um, on the investigation that it could not have been an, like an accident by nature. Some, somebody had to move this, like they've been calling it a branch or a log, but it was originally a branch that was cut up. A 70 inch, 120 pound log, Schaefer says. The incident hasn't been ruled a crime, but ODNR confirms the falling of the log wasn't a natural occurrence. If this had happened to anybody else in our community, she would be the first person to stand up and say, we need answers for this family. That's why the Schaefer family and local business community are joining forces in hopes of getting answers. We believe that somewhere somebody knows something. If you were hiking these trails at any time on Labor Day and snap photos or took video, you're asked to contact ODNR or Crime Stoppers. The photo that you send today may not make much sense today, but it could make sense two weeks from now, tomorrow, a month from now. I don't really need anything, um, just some answers. And Crime Stoppers is offering a $10,000 reward if you have any information or even photos from Labor Day at Old Man's Cave, you're asked to share them with authorities. In Hocking Hills, Karen Johnson, WLWT News 5.